Yo guys, it's your boy Roman and it is super early but I have a train to catch and I'm almost late <laughs> Alright, so finally got to Aras. Yes, yes, and yes. Okay, where do I go? There or here? Let's go that way. Alright, so you want to know what is odd or unfortunate about today is that I looked up some places to go in Arras about 15 places that I wanted to really visit and the thing is I can't use my phone to even look at these places because to use Google Maps I need it to consist constantly and it constantly to always be navigating where to turn where to go because I can't look at the map and just boom know where to go and know how it functions so I'm just walking around like a madman Alright, so I stumbled upon this place, um, Co-op Tika just had to stop there and I'll show you guys why. Look at these prices. I've never seen a pair of glasses like, I think reading glasses that cost 215 euros. That's crazy. No, seriously, with a 215 euro pair of glasses, like, what does it do? Does it make you have like, what do you call that, the thing that Superman has? X-ray vision. So I don't know how good those glasses are for you to be paying 215 euros. That's ridiculous. At least in my book it is. Looking left, looking right, that's how you cross the road. I think this is one of the places that was on my list. So this looks like the Grand Plus, I think. Osaka ah, Subarashi <gasps> We can see the Japanese writing there My Japanese is so bad I don't remember how to pronounce that But I'll say Subarashi Alright so I totally forgot to try out my new glasses <laughs> I think they look nice But well, they make everything look so dark Yeah because they're sunglasses Duh Alright so Where am I? Let's see Boy, I tell you, I'm famished. I haven't eaten. Oh, that looks nice. Let's go over there. I haven't eaten from morning. Even though I don't usually eat this early, I would be at the gym. And then I would just go home, shower, get some work done. Oh, look at that cat. Meow. Ah, Subarashi. Y'all see that baby? Beautiful. Gorgeous. Everything that I want. Sell you. <laughs> so hard. Alright, so let's let me explain this one. Oh, let me get this thing first. Yes. It's real beautiful. Alright, so what just happened was that um, while I was filming, there's this guy that was adjacent to me. And I apparently heard that I was talking and I was like, he looked at me, but I thought nothing of it. He went into his apartment and I realized that it was open. So I was like, why did he leave his door open? Because I'm filming is that he doesn't mind me capturing a part of his apartment. And so when I reached his apartment, he was there waiting, looking at me. And I was like, oh my God, it's an invitation. <laughs> I'm joking. But um, he was there waiting. So, and he said, Sally, I'm like, ah, oh, Sally. So that was pretty weird, but cool. Maybe he was fascinated because he wasn't sure what language I was speaking or he just wanted to see me close up. Oh yeah, I wonder if I could go in. Ah, okay, let's, okay, let's go in this stretch. Let's, oh, it's closed. Is it? Yeah, it's closed. Unfortunately.
the thing is with this vlogging I'm just talking and showing you showing you guys buildings architecture infrastructure nature and that's really it I hope something interesting would happen that would really make this video exciting for you guys we're like wow that's fabulous spectacular is that a rainbow wait can you guys see the rainbow or not? Can you see the rainbow? Oh, it was that like an advertisement? Can you see the rainbow? Oh my god, that is a rainbow. Alright, so you guys have to say that you literally are able to see the rainbow. Y'all can see the rainbow. That is... And it's moving. <laughs> oh, nice. Look at this graffiti. Hold on. What's that? let I have no idea what that's saying, but this looks, it looks beautiful nonetheless. To be honest, based on what I'm seeing, I think I kind of went out of the town center because this is not a town center. I think I actually took a wrong turn and just went towards these suburbs all right so the train station is here and the university is there so i'm not going to go that direction i'm going to go back this direction and see what's out here this is definitely a little nice chill spot you could come here with friends you could have a seat or by yourself i love poetry so i could sit here get some inspiration and just look over here it's really nice that little house thing in the water it's also pretty cool hey there hey hey how are you doing i can see their feet moving like are there where well, their feet moving up see mimicking how to swim i honestly think this is the town center I think so because I'm seeing people, I'm seeing more stores. So yeah, I'm definitely assuming that this is the centre ville, I think. Monsieur, qu'est-ce que ça Est-ce que ça c'est le centre ville? Non, le centre ville c'est là-bas. Ok, merci. Tout droit. Tout droit. Ok, merci. All right, so I was wrong. This, this is not the centre ville. This has to be the center of Ville, Centre Ville. Alright, so I've already been here before, so there's no need to really stay. Now I'll go to the other side. Boy, believe me, I'm tired. I'm hungry. Or at least thirsty. This is a really nice garden spot, like seriously, it's really lovely. Got this nice tree to give you some shade. You could put a little chair, lawn chair there, sit, have a drink or two. It's really nice, it's really lovely. And then this beautiful, gorgeous, spectacular, masterpiece, work of art. Wait, let me see if it's open. I don't think it's open. Here is so calm, I don't even want to talk too loudly. Wow, it's really quiet, it's really nice. Birds, nature, <laughs> buildings, it's really nice. Whoa, this looks fabulous. What is this?
this one I'm seeing, I'm seeing people coming out of their houses. So this looks like an apartment complex, which looks darn nice. Aras has a great scenery, great buildings, great architecture. And what else I love is the green space. There's some sort of tree, there's some sort of plant, some sort of green area. As you can see, it's beautiful. I won't go any further because it's all the same. Lovely guys, lovely. Alright, so I'm finally here guys, took forever to find. Let's see what it's all about, what the hype is. So let's see what this is like. First of all, got some bread. This is what I ordered. There's cheese all over it with mushrooms and I'll put the ingredients there. Here's my water. One thing though, they should have been more. Like, should have been like five, they just two. Okay, Yosh guys, so my trip to Aras has finally come to an end. So the restaurant, it was pretty good. It was pretty good. My only, my only complaint is that they gave me two pieces of bread when they should have given me more and the bread makes the food taste better. So how much would I give it? I'll give it eight. Why I didn't give it higher than eight was one, I would have personally liked it a little bit more spicy. It was not bland, it was just not spicy. The second reason I didn't even give it another point to make it 10 was that with the blend of spice, their spices, it became a little bit cloying afterwards. As for the cheesecake, the dessert, I tasted, I think they put brown sugar there, I could taste the sugar, but the banana was overpowering, it was really good, and I personally like, like banana, so that means a plus. And overall, I would give the cheesecake, maybe even eight too, because the banana was superb, and that's what I liked. So it didn't feel cheesecake, -y. it felt more like a banana dessert. So in terms of my opinion of Aras today, so I personally find that Aras is a beautiful city in terms of architecture, infrastructure, that much I really like. Another great point is that almost everywhere I go, there's some sort of green space. When I say green space, I'm not talking about preserved space, but simply to say that there are trees or some sort of plants. Aras is definitely my number one green spot so far. Just even now, where I am, there are lots of trees here absolutely a lot of treats so nonetheless guys that is it for my video this week if you enjoyed it again don't forget to smash that like button hit that subscription bell and simply tap that notification button and my next city to visit is i don't know yes i think i'll be visiting betiun sometime next week after my birthday i'll be visiting betiun then after that i don't know which other city yes a, a friend invited me to rains or rains however you pronounce the word so those might be on my list, I'm not sure, but if you guys would like for me to visit any city in particular, it doesn't have to be in this in this region or the France, it could be almost anywhere depending on the train ticket. Of course, just simply leave that in the comments below. And I'll see you guys next week. Ciao ciao.